Seven degrees in Rudoso, seven inches of snow, Eric. Yeah, and the uh, latest check of the wind chill feels like it's 15 below zero in Rudoso. Yikes. That's some cold stuff. Beautiful desert covered landscape as we look back towards Albuquerque from Rio Rancho. Can't make up the downtown buildings. We still have some low cloud cover overhead uh, in northwest uh, in the northwest corner of the Albuquerque Metro. We're in the cloud right now and it's still flurrying. We've got about one lane of blacktop there in both directions on Coors. Look at how slow the cars are coming down the hill right there. First the snow, uh, the wind kicking in and then the bitter cold settling in. Another storm on the way for Tuesday, much milder by the upcoming weekend. So give it a little time. It's going to get better. Rare blizzard warning issued for Bernalillo and Valencia counties, Torrance County, the I-40 corridor through the East Mountains, all the way out to about Klein's Corners uh, until 11 this morning. We have the potential to see the wind gusts in the 55 mile per hour range, making visibilities down to nothing at times and travel near impossible. Travel is not advised in blizzard warning conditions. 12 was our temperature earlier this morning. I'm not sure that will come back for that number, a one to four inch snowfall, then very cold and windy. As we head into the midday and afternoon hours, you can see the focus for what's left of the heavier bands of snows to push into southern New Mexico. Tonight, the snow ends a partly cloudy sky. Coldest temperatures in 10 years since that historic natural natural gas outage back in February of 2011 we will drop to four in Albuquerque, way below zero for eastern and northern New Mexico. Monday, a brief break in the action. Note Albuquerque barely warming to get above freezing and in northwest New Mexico, some late day snow could be pushing back on in. And then on Tuesday, we have this weather system moving through with the potential for a one to two inch accumulating snow snow before we look ahead towards Wednesday, lingering rain and snow showers, high only 38, eventually warmer temperatures by the end of the week. But yeah, we may have to wait until Saturday to get back up above 50 degrees once again.